geothermal energy is uh, energy extracted from the earth and it can be done in, in various different ways. If you go really deep, then you can extract uh, really uh, hot water from underground. And that hot water can drive uh, power turbines that provide electricity. Second type of geothermal energy comes from uh, lower temperatures that are cooler water that you can circulate around your house or around your community. And then the third type is uh, what we call geothermal heat pumps, which can be installed on houses and commercial buildings. And those heat pumps are very, very shallow, just literally underneath your garden. And those allow you to heat and cool your home throughout the year. The first geothermal resource in the United States was developed in roughly 1960, 1961, outside of San Francisco, called the Geysers Geothermal Field. And it was apparent to the engineers and scientists working in that field that, that there was probably a lot more, certainly in the Western United States, and that an organization created to at least assist in educating people interested in knowing more about geothermal was was probably the driver of the formation of the Geothermal Resources Council. They wanted to put together an association that created an environment where they could share their research, share their innovations, and and really get together to, to understand where they can push geothermal energy forward in the future. We realized, the board realized over many years that, that we needed to become more uh, familiar to people outside the geothermal industry. So we needed to, to perform a rebranding of our association so that we could, we could get that more approachable branding around us for, for the general public. Frankly, most people don't know about geothermal energy. So in order to, to really promote geothermal energy to the public, we need to get the information out about geothermal energy. The more educated we are about clean energy versus fossil fuels, the wiser we'll, we'll be when it comes to making decisions. And of course, those decisions are what sources of power do we want to use and, and, and frankly, what elected officials do we want to support who may or may not support clean energy? Geothermal rising is promoting geothermal energy. It's, it's about how we can use the earth to save the earth. That will have a huge impact on mitigating climate change. An organization like Geothermal Rising with an educational mandate um, is what really is necessary. Um, it's one of many tools that are that are necessary for us to improve the world. So I I remain optimistic that Geothermal Rising is is heading in the right direction. So so the reason I'm passionate about geothermal energy is because I believe it it is the solution for climate change. What we've got to realize in society in general is we have to change. And to do that, we need renewable and clean energy sources. We need solar, we need wind, and we need geothermal energy.